So we are at um, battery, at 31 battery, and this it dead ends right down here. And then actually just down here at the little cul-de-sac, there's a little walk, walking path that goes back to the, um, to uh, right over to the fifth hole of the heritage course. So it's very convenient for, for you or renters uh, during, during the golf tournament if you are here. Um, they've done a nice job on the outside. The roof looks, we'll have to look, but the, the roof looks to be newer. I like the little brick touches that they put in throughout the driveway. Coming through the front door, we come into newer flooring. They have not uh, taken the popcorn off the ceilings, but looks like the, the home has been freshly painted. This is a very nice bright room. I'm here at about 3.30, 4 o'clock, and it, it certainly shows, shows nicely in terms of the lighting. I hope it's picking up in the, in the video. And then you have a beveled tray in the dining room. Nice dining table, so look back at the front door. To the right. Now they didn't run this flooring into the kitchen and the family room, but this too has the nice high ceilings. And uh, it is a double-sided fireplace, so you have the fireplace, it, it's wood burning over on this end. And then this goes out to the, the deck and patio. They slide very nicely, nice doors. I don't know if those were replaced, but they, they work well. There's a little yard over here and you don't really, you don't look directly into anyone else. You see a little bit of the home behind, but um, it's, a, it's a nice size deck. And then a nice sun deck down below. And the pool is, is just over, over over the side here. It's it's a little squeezed in here, but, but it certainly works and there's a, a walkway around it. Coming back inside, give you another look at this room. Nice little eating nook. And the kitchen has been has been updated nicely. They didn't change these cabinets out uh, when they when they did the remodel, but I think they're they're okay. Changed out to all stainless. It's a very comfortable comfortable space, comfortable room. And then you have the washer dryer, the laundry with the laundry sink and they have a full bath tucked in here as well. And then this goes down to down to the garage. And this is just some storage. So it's a, it's tight. Um, you can see they have one car in here, and there's not a heck of a lot of room for for another car, unless you had a real mini mini. Coming back through, we'll take a look at the at the bedrooms, and they are all down on this side of the home you have some storage in here nice bright sunny room here with the twin beds and the peaked ceiling and right around the corner is another similar bedroom and in here they have a queen 
locked closet here. And they've updated this bath. That's cute. Skylight looks good. They did take the uh, popcorn out in here. A new shower with, with a new shower door. This is nicely done. And then over here is your master. It's not a huge master, but again, nicely done. And of course, the, the loft, the height and the ceiling certainly helps uh, give, give it a spacious feel. They did not tackle the master bath. So you still have the soaking tub and stand-up shower, nice size stand-up shower. The vanities are definitely lower. We have a little water closet here. There are two vanities in here, but they have left this to be customized, except for a, a little bit of updates on the light fixtures. And then you have walk-in closet. So that is what we have here at 31 Battery. I hope it helps, and I'll talk to you soon.